Well, it's essentially my job to make sure that all the different technical elements of a show come together. So I'm part of the set design, the light design, the sound design, all those things that make up the show. Technically, I'm in charge of overseeing um, this show in particular. I was responsible for designing the set, making the flats, um, and then once the design phase is through, I'm in charge of basically corralling all the texts together, getting them on jobs, showing them what they need to do, and make sure that everything gets done. Well, one of our big challenges is that we're not actually in the theater a lot, so we don't have a lot of space to build. Um, so once after we can build all that we want, but as long as we don't have a space to put them up in, we're sort of at a standstill. Um, another challenge is that this show takes place in two different areas, um, but we needed to make sure that both those areas were very defined and they both had walls. Um, so we actually had to come up with some pretty unique tricks um, to make sure that you know it would seem that you're in these two separate, very different houses. Um, you're gonna, gonna have to come, you know, see the show to see what they are. I'd say the hardest part about being a tech director is just that I have so many techs, um, which is great because there's a lot of people who are involved, um, but corralling them together a lot of times is very difficult. I've got, you know, the hair and makeup people, the sound people, the light crew, the props people. We're actually in the prop room right now, and as you can see, there's a lot of random assorted articles that they all have to find. Um, I also have to make sure that everything is cohesive as a design, that the lighting design and sound design don't conflict with the set or draw away too much of it. Um, and a big part of my job is actually training because we have a lot of you know freshmen, sophomore technicians, people who it's their first show. Um, and we want to make sure that they know how to do everything. We don't want to hand them a saw and tell them, all right, do the job, and they don't have any ideas. So it's a big training. Um, but you know, it's so fun to do. So. Where I see myself in 10 years is probably back here. Uh, I'm just kidding. Uh, I love Saxon Stage a lot, and I do hope to visit eventually back, but um, my real dream, not gonna lie, is I really want to work at Disney World. So, a little bit about me, fun fact. Uh, they should come see the Children's Hour because we have an all-star cast. These are um, a lot of people that I've worked with for four whole years. So we've got amazing actors, we've got amazing tech that I am leading, not to brag. Um, but it's really, it's kind of the culmination, and especially now that we have such amazing directing at Langley Theater now, like you should come out and see it, because it's really good. Movies. Thanks for watching, everybody. Come check out the Children's Hour at Langley High School, April 3rd to 5th.